Welcome back to Football News Center, where we bring you the latest updates from the world of football. In today's video, we'll be discussing the haunting sight that Manchester United fans were faced with during their match against Bayern Munich. Harry Kane, the lethal marksman for Bayern Munich, outshone Manchester United's captain, Bruno Fernandes, with his exceptional performance. Kane's flick with the outside of his boot set up Kingsley Coman for Bayern Munich's winning goal, highlighting the vast difference in class between these two European superpowers. Thomas Tuchel, the Bayern Munich manager, has referred to the acquisition of Harry Kane as an act of grand larceny, emphasizing the steal they made by signing the England captain. And it was evident on the pitch that night, as Kane's brilliance overshadowed United's struggling striker, Rasmus Hodgland. While Hodgland has had some success in European competitions, scoring five times in the Champions League, he still lacks the experience and consistency that Kane brings to the game. His physical duel with Deodopamecano was a mismatch, leaving him isolated and without service throughout the match. In contrast, Kane thrived in Bayern's total control of the game and capitalized on the opportunity to put Coleman clean through. Paul Scholes, a former United player, expressed his disappointment at the club's failure to sign Kane and Declan Rice last summer. However, the reality is that United no longer holds the same allure for players of Kane's caliber. He saw a more enticing challenge in Bayern Munich and has flourished since joining the club. The contrasting paths of Manchester United and Bayern Munich were evident in this match. The quality of players like Joshua Kimmich and Antony, who play for Bayern, far exceeds that of United's recruits like Sofian Amrabat and Jamal Musiala. United is paying the price for years of questionable recruitment decisions. As Luke Shaw joined the list of injured players, a sense of fatalism crept over the crowd. The fans knew all too well what happens when this United side falls behind. Confidence evaporates, setbacks turn into embarrassments. The demands for change and decisive action from owner Sir Jim Ratcliffe will only grow louder. In this match, United lacked the belief and hunger for victory. Their fate in the competition was out of their hands, and it showed in their performance. The Munich Ultras even taunted United fans, calling Old Trafford a library. The empty red seats at the end of the match reflected the disappointment and frustration of the diehard supporters. Harry Kane, on the other hand, must have felt relieved that he had chosen Bayern Munich over Manchester United. The tempestuous soap opera that has defined United in recent years is not something he would have wanted any part of. Instead, he is focused on pursuing the ultimate prize, with Bayern Munich winning the Champions League. And that's all for today's update. What are your thoughts on Manchester United's performance and Harry Kane's impact? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more football news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.